still going. Fuck's sake. So, um. I watched the first episode of World Man Man. So, uh, Kimi ga nozom in. It's a. This sort of rom com farce, right? Rom com farce. Dom Darce, Rumpel Stiltskin, Bumble Bill Bin. And, uh, so, so. At first, I was sort of like, it's shit. But, you know, the thing about anime is that uh, all of it looks like shit, actually. If, if you're really like, trying to dig in. Although, definitely, some stuff looks more jank than others. Overall, none of this stuff looks good enough to really exclude the jank qualities of the other stuff. And the art style, overall, is, is like, too sort of self-similar, in a way, to even be like, oh, this is bad, so it gives you, like, a postmodern feeling akin to, like, the Campbell's soup cans that are different colors. So, like, Kimi ga nozumu Ayan is a, the big hair type of anime where the big hair actually has an anti-gravity. Instead of just having no gravity, it has an anti-gravity. Um, and and so it's it's just a farce romance anime, and 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 something about the vibe was just chill, you know. The plot seemed insufferable. It, it seemed like a. It, it said it, there was like a Gundam parody. I was watching sci-fi anime first episodes, uh, but I was just watching the original show. Uh, I don't know if it's bad on purpose, but you know. What's good on purpose, anyway? Um, uh, so, uh, that was okay. I might continue it, but it seemed a bit too self serious. Just a tad. A bit not vibey enough to continue that way. And of course, I could watch it, but something about sort of watching shows this way is a bit more like you, you don't actually have to binge every show you know if if you feel like it great but like you can just watch the first episode of each that's that's how they're released that's how they're written is episode by episode you know you could watch the first episode of like breaking bad and one could argue, oh, that's just much better experience. You could watch the first season. But the problem is that, you know, you have a bunch of different cults of people all saying different things like, oh, it gets better in this season, but this particular episode is good. And it shows this character of the thing. And overall, you can kind of agree that, uh, you know, they got whatever they got from it. And they can't really argue that much because you know even if you're saying oh season one is the best that's good but the rest are bad you still have the people nipping at your heels who are like oh the show's just kind of eh I mean what's the point of taking a moderate position on like breaking bad you know so you should take all positions or whatever uh then there was a uh, dragonaut uh Revival or whatever. I fucking forget. Responsible. So, resonance. Yeah. And, and, uh. This has a serial killer who is actually a monster. It, it sort of feels like, um. You know, one way or another, it might be. It might leak out in some way that, like, there's a monster fucking killing people. Is this, like, a new appearance that 
I wonder if the, the police officers in the anime world were all just like, oh yeah, it looks like it's a killing. Because by a human. You see, she was torn in half. And there wasn't a tearing in a half machine. And these look like claw marks that would be used to tear someone in half. So, 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 how is that show? Well, I didn't see any space element. There's no space element to that. No, no space element at all. So, I'm confused uh, in that regard. Oh shit, this is gonna be a fucking... It's gonna be, uh, vertical. Because I'm shit at anything. Fuck. Fuck, I hate myself. I wanna die. I wanna kill myself. I'm not good at anything. I'm a waste of space. I'm a bad person because I can't film horizontally. Then there was a, yeah, a Dragonaut Resonance. And that's like a, I don't know, this guy, he gets in like a, this sort of Apollo 13 or whatever, 14 sort of crash. And he's the only one to survive. His dad, who's fucking dumb, apparently crashed the uh, rocket ship or whatever. And his sister survives as like a a, a, a meme beast of uh, I'm not actually your sister, but I am your sister. That's probably what it would be. What do I rate this? I rate this uh, square out of uh, Taurus. I rate it square out of Taurus. And it seemed, uh, you know, I, I, I like how the women are designed in the show because I'm a sexist. Because, because it's a sleek design. They're sleekly designed. <laughs> That's the level at which I observe it. I do not have a brain. I do not like brains. Brains are dumb. You can call me sexist, you can call me that, but do not call me retarded. That is a point of pride. Ooh, baby, I love That's the only point of watching anime. Really, really? That's the only point of watching anime. And it's more than sexist. Because sexists have reasons for being sexist. I'm just uh, a caveman. <laughs> rock, 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 rock. Uh, gotcha man crowds. They have the sort of like gradients on their hair. Or the sort of like a... a rotoscoped or whatever patterns parallax whatever you'd say on their hair that shades it in two different parts again this is like one of those like folk things or whatever with a bunch of like japanese mythology stuff somehow linked into robots you just have gotcha mans which are like creatures or whatever, somewhat like uh, demons or whatever the fuck you have in Japan. Fucking creatures. Creatures of creaturely extent and kind. Creaturely creatures. Uh, it kind of reminded me of the, the bleach arc that's like a the Soulbringer arc. Because all the characters were sort of like, oh, this character doesn't seem like they'll matter. That's, that's good to know. But they probably would matter. It's just that it's a bit of a, I, I, don't, I don't know, like a, they're just supposed to be like kind of gauche. I don't know. I have so little knowledge of what I'm talking about. 
Uh, show looks cool. But the funny thing is, like, the action in Dragonaut uh, Apocalypse looks like, I don't know, more choreographed or more sort of, like, limbic. As opposed to this, where a lot of the action was, like, CG. Of course, it's only the first episode. But then it's also that, besides the sort of uh, uh, Japanese viewpoint of good and evil as characterized by these sort of supernatural forces, well, especially evil, I guess, because it's just like a bunch of blocks is this evil thing that the gotchamen like, beat up. What the fuck is up with that? You just have, like, uh, decentralized mooks of, of, uh, the kingdom of, uh, vaguely harmful mookdom of the underworld. And the underworld is always, it always has, like, yeah, we have our own sort of politics, but overall we're, we're also sort of assholes. You know, it's very Greek. Um... Uh, 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 so like, um, then final show, Gene Shaft, this show looked like shit and moved like shit, and it also had shit dialogue, probably the worst that I saw. Bitch just gets assassinated because her jeans are too good. You have too good jeans. We're fucking terrorists. We don't care if we die because we're terrorists. We like inciting terror in people because we're terrorists. I am a guy to you because I am a woman robot. Well, you are wrong to think that men are self-destructive. Men are not actually self-destructive. I cannot provide data on that. I must kill that man who killed uh, my guy. Wait, there is a barrier. There is a barrier that you ran right into. <laughs> Killer soundtrack, though. If not a bit too killer. It's just like, calm the fuck down. You know? Do it for, like, a better show. Or just have, like, a sort of, like, Google Earth or whatever thing. With Alexa, like, scrolling over the animations of spaceships. With a sort of, like, um, half doom metal, half new metal sort of harmonics like wah, 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 like Led's fucking Joplin <laughs> Joplin James Joplin uh, man I'm so funny uh 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 so yeah that's my conclusion for anime first impressions they go in the I'm gonna give a uh, uh, I'm, I'm gonna give fucking Dragonaut Revolution, I'm gonna give that a four cheeseburgers out of five pinatas. I'm gonna give, uh, then second place is, 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 uh, Nozomu Kimi ga Nozomu Ayan, which I give eight enchiladas out of five holocausts. Then third place. Third place? Man, I'm just gonna have to place. I'm, 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 I'm just gonna have to place. You know what I'm gonna have to place? I'm gonna have to place. Gotcha men crowds, you know? At the end of the day, you know, it had style to it. That's all I can say. It's, uh, mm. And the music is probably good because it's from that one guy, like, uh, uh, 
I forget, Digibro made a video about him. You can look it up, the, uh, the musician behind Gotham in crowds. And fourth place. Actually, now that I'm actually thinking about it, I'm giving third place uh, to uh, 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 the fucking uh, Gene Shaft show. And I'm switching their scores. I'm going to give uh, the score to Gene Shaft is going to be a uh, magnesium milk, milk of magnesia, George Bush portrait, portrait of uh, uh, Bashar al-Assad's hemorrhoids. And uh, I'm going to give uh, the fourth place winner... Uh, gotcha in crowds. I'm gonna give that a red velvet cake. A, a red velvet cake dipped in ketchup.